What's up everyone and welcome back for more Let's Play Ocarina of Time. In the last episode I got the bigger round sword which is enormous and is twice the power of the Master Sword. So I reached Goron's city and there is a sculpture on the back. Interesting, time to take it out. Oh my god. Down that fell. Hmm, let's see, can I reach it from the bottom, like from here? Up there. Hmm. Don't think I can. So let me take. I think I need to go over here. And let's see if I can redo that without failing. Ow. I said without failing. So let's take a really, really decent walk all over this. Oh. I said, without failing. What do you don't understand about the word without? I mean, it is without, it's not with. So, let's see, can I do it right now? I guess I can. And that works. So, you might have seen there is a little Goron rolling over the floor. Laughing? I don't know. Oh, whoops, that's one uh, floor to low. too low, I guess. He should be up here, somewhere. And there he is, and what you need to do is bomb him. Like that. Wow, I did it in one shot. How could you do this to me? You, your guys are servant! Hear my name and tremble. I am Particle, hero of the Gorons. Wait a minute, that, that's my name, not yours. Who dare you to misuse my name? I'll now nah, let's not do that. What? Your name is also Particle? Then you must be the legendary the Dungo Buster and hero, Particle. My dad is Darunia. Do you remember him? Of course we do, from the silly Serious song Dance. Dad named me Particle after you, because you're so brave. It's a cool name, I really like it. Particle, you're a hero to us Gorons. I'm so glad to meet you. Please give me your autograph, sign it, to my friend, Particle of the Gorons. Oh. I guess it's not a good time to ask you for this. Please help everyone. My dad Tarunia went to the fire temple. A dragon is inside. If we don't hurry up, even my dad will be eaten by the dragon. <laughs> you better try to calm him down, if you can. Maybe we'll calm down if we talk to him. Let's ask him about that dragon. A long time ago, there was an evil dragon named Fulvagia living in this mountain. That dragon was very scary. He ate Gorons. Using a huge hammer, the hero of the Gorons, BOOM! Destroyed it just like that. This is a myth from long ago, but it's true. I know, because my dad is a descendant of the hero. <laughs> so let's ask him about the Gorons then. Everybody was taken to the fire temple. While my dad was out, Gandor's followers came and took them all away. All of them will be eaten by Volvagia. Dad said that Gandorf has revived Volvagia. As a warning to those who might oppose him, Ganondorf is going to feed them all to Vavagia. Dad went to the fire temple all by himself to try to save everyone. Please help, Particle. I'll give you this heat resistant tunic. And we get the Goron tunic. Now we got them all, and the doors will open. So, before entering the forest temple, I already got the fire suit and the water suit. Interesting. And this is the Goron tunic, which makes us look red. Now what I'm gonna do is... Can I climb up there? Yes, I can. And I'm gonna go here. And... This thing can be moved back. So let's do that. And we're inside Death Mountain Crate, and since we got the fire tunic, we won't get burn damage. So, I am gonna do it like this, and there's Sheik again. He or she always messes up with my plans whenever I'm doing something. It is something that grows over time, a true friendship, a feeling in the heart that becomes even stronger over time. The passion of friendship will soon blossom into righteous power, and through it, you will know which way to go. This song is dedicated to the power of the heart. Listen to the Bolero Fire. Another song, nice. 
down A, down A, right down, right down, which is the Balero of Fire. Interesting enough. And now we get a little medley. Which looks pretty cool actually. And because of that, we learned the Bolero of Fire, and now we can warp to Death Mountain Crater whenever we wish. So that's good. Particle, I'll see you again. So we try to reach him or her, but there's fire. And because of that... Boom! Nothing pretty much seemed to happen. So... Let me see how many skull shots I got. Oh, 50, that's good. Now I can get another, um, what's it called? Reward for free. That dude. That's better. And I'm gonna escape from here. Now we're back here again, and I'll see you once I reach Kakariko Village. So, see you in a moment. Alright, so in, I'm in here, and as you can see, we freed all the humans at the other side. We just need to free the leader. Did I talk to this guy yet? The curse has been broken. Thank you. Here's a reward for you. And I get... Fucking bomb shoes. Seriously, I don't need fucking bomb shoes. I already got those. From Bunchu Bowling. God, I have terrible memories to that game. The curse has been broken. Thank you. Here's a reward for you. And I get a heart piece. That's better. So, having done that, I only need to clear the dude in the middle. Which is the full 100. Sculpture us. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is... Indeed, I am gonna play the Serenade of Water and warp myself to Lake Helia, because I'm pretty much done here. So, let's go straight to Lake Helia. And we're at Lake Hilia. The only problem though is that there is no lake. Yeah, the water is gone. Must be another one of Ganondorf's lousy, mean, stupid tricks. Anyways, it doesn't really matter. Hmm. Yeah, I just blanked out for a moment and checked my guide without even noting. So, that's a growl. I still discuss growls. So, I'll still take it out. I don't need rubies, I already got enough. And what I'm gonna do right now is go to the Scarecrows. Remember from a while ago where we played this song? And I'm gonna go there. And do like that. It must be around here. Yep, there it is. It's the same dude. Now what I'm gonna do is play the song. It's the ocarina. Play that song. Yeah, I remember it right. Oh yeah, that's it. That's the tune. You rock. I'm blown away. Oh no, no. I didn't forget the song. I never forget anything. But I just feel like we're warning you, baby. I have a good idea. My buddy Pierre is wandering around, so play that tune when you want to call him. I'll tell him to help you if he's nearby and hears that song. So now we activated the Scarecrow song, and whenever we need to get somewhere, we use this song. And I'll take this one out. So what's next on the list to collect? Let me spy. Oh yeah, of course, remember where I planted the um, beanstalk thing. Or actually just the plant. I planted the magic beam and now I can stand on it. And it will lure me up. I said it will lure me up. Anyways, you can use this to reach the fishing area and I will go there in a moment. And I can go over here. And straight over there. Where's this thing going? Jeez, seriously. And it will go up here. And whoa, I think I should have gone up there. 
So what I'm gonna do is go like this. Yeah, I took a lie, a nice trip for like. Oh, oh my god. Stupid crow. Where is it? Where is the fucker? Yeah, stupid mistake. Don't piss me off. I'll just fucking hoot shut your brains out. So climb all the way to the top. And at the top here is another heart piece and we collected two which is good and I'm gonna go down <laughs> ouch that hurts that hurts I know and shut up I know I'm worried about Saria too but I'm not gonna go there yet I got more stuff to do seriously and what I'm gonna do is go over here and get off here and here we are we're back at the fishing Bond. and I'm gonna cut it off here I'm gonna take the blue suit just for the heck of it because I'm near water I don't know why but I just feel like it yeah I'm, I'm really into yawning as well I know anyways in the next episode I'm gonna get some fishing done here and get some rewards for it and I'll see you guys then so thanks for watching make sure to like comment sub and peace out